What's going on guys, Chase Golden here with a brand new video for you guys today, coming at you with some more Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Uh, we're going to be checking out a specific part of World of Light. It is uh, northeast, you guys can see the location here. It's basically Kirby's Gourmet Race. Now, there's two reasons I'm showing you this. One, it's just a really cool area in World of Light. Number two, I'm going to be showing you guys uh, the path that I took in order to get first place. So the idea is you have to collect as many food items in uh, one run as possible. And um, if you don't collect enough, then you won't get the first place. There's a first, second, and third place. So the second and third place, um, I can't remember the exact numbers you need to get. I think for third place, you just need to get like anything under six or something. Or I don't know, around there. And I think like between six and ten is second place, if I recall correctly. And then for first place, you need to collect 11 food items. Um, so for second and third place, what happens is it, is, it, it spawns a spirit. Just a normal spirit. But for first place, it actually uh, spawns a new fighter that you can uh, add to your roster if you defeat. So we're going to skip over to the, uh, to the section in a second here where uh, I actually... Um, you know had my my correct run to collect 11 food items So if you guys are trying to do this yourselves, then you know the exact path to take So this is the run if you guys are trying to get first place in uh, this section This is the path you guys have to take um, It took me about 10 minutes to figure it out on my own if you guys want to figure it out on your own obviously, you know uh, Don't watch this part, <laughs> but uh, if you guys want to know how to do it, then this is the path I ended up taking um, again, it took me a, a couple tries to kind of figure out the the right path. Uh, there's a lot of back and forth be, uh, between uh, the various paths. Uh, but once you get the uh, 11 items collected, like you'll see uh, right here on the pedestal, the um, the new character will spawn, which is King DDD. So you can go ahead and fight King DDD and uh, add him to your roster in World of Light. And of course, if you haven't unlocked them in, you know, outside of World of Light, unlocking characters in World of Light will also unlock them outside of World of Light. Uh, but it doesn't work vice versa. So if you unlock characters outside of World of Light, you still have to unlock them inside World of Light. Does that make sense? Anyways, pretty confusing stuff. Maybe, I don't know, but uh, there you guys have it. A little look at the uh, Kirby's Gourmet Race section in World of Light and uh, a little bit of a guide on how to uh, get that first place so you guys can get King DDD unlocked. Let me know how you guys are enjoying Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Let me know um, uh, how far you guys are in World of Light. I'm pretty far. If you guys have been watching my live streams, I'm uh, I'm about to take on Galeem or at least go to that section. I, I believe there's like another world once you go encounter him that you have to go through a bunch of other levels first. Um, I think I seen someone streaming that very briefly for like two minutes. I wasn't sure if that's where they were, um, but I don't know. I'm not sure how that works yet. I'll find out live on stream if you guys want to tune into that. Uh, Twitch.tv slash jskeleton92. Otherwise, if you guys enjoyed this video, if you found it useful, make sure you guys smash the like button, subscribe, the comment, share, and all that awesome stuff. Hit the notification bell so guys never miss a new upload. I'll catch you beautiful people very soon in another video. Like always, until next time, game on.